everyone, my name is Sung. I'm 12 years old and today uh, I'm now I study in Harvitab Secondary School. I'm not born in Ho Chi Minh City, but I have the opportunity to study and live in Ho Chi Minh City. Now, today I will take you around Ho Chi Minh City to uh, contemplate the history relics. Let's go. You cannot skip Duke Ba Church. Look, my church is not restored, but you can see its architecture outside. It is colored tight. The golf Duke architect around it. That's because why the Duke Bar church it attracts a lot of tourists in and outside Vietnam. Front of it, it's a big Maria statue with a garden with flower. Great idea for you to relax and selfie here. Built in 1887 to 1880. So now they need to restore to 2027 because of COVID. Duc Ba Church is not only a church, but it's an iconic of Ho Chi Minh City. When you already visit the Duc Ba Church, you cannot be skip the city post office. It's in the right turn of the Duc Ba Church. Now let's go with me to visit it. It was built by the French colonial and it has the same architecture it, with the Duc Ba Church too. It's a Gothic architect in the city post office. There's some small soft silk stamps, souvenirs, high quality silk made by handmade. And this can make you surprised that city post office is still working right now and you can send your letter to anywhere. After exploring the city post office, you can walk to Yin Duk Lop or Yin Thung Nhuc for about 400 meters. It was built in 1962 by Ngo Vic Thu and Yin Duk Lop combined the modern and the traditional structure. Because of that, Yin Duk Lop is an architectural masterpiece, especially in 30 April 1975. Yin Đồng Lập has been the icon of Vietnam people. When a tank guard Yin Đồng Lập door and the Vietnam flag on Yin Đồng Lập top, the liberty of the sound. This image has entered the hearts of Vietnamese people. To visit some historical lakes, you can walk for about 700 meters to city people committees or Nguyễn Nguyễn Walk Street where are attract a lot of teenagers and tourists. You can relax by walking or take a coffee in coffee shop or shopping in shopping mall. Walk for a few meters. You will see Bạch Đằng Wharf. It's one of the most popular wharf in Ho Chi Minh City. Bạch Đằng Wharf is not only a wharf, but you can also use it water bus to view all Ho Chi Minh City in Saigon River. When you sit on his water bus, you can contemplate Landmark 81. Landmark 81 is the tallest tower in Vietnam and one, one in ten tallest tower in the world. In that river road, you can un easily see five-star hotel like the Majestic Rex Hotel, con the Continental, but the Wharf also a place to talk traditional festival. Here, don't forget to enjoy seafood and restaurant. Also visit the place that I say by take a two floor bus. See, for sure have more history relics like the Dakuti or the History Museum. Occasion, I will guide you to it. Thank you for listening. Bye bye and welcome to Ho Chi Minh City.